Hello everyone. Again, we're coming to the end of the week. It's Saturday and uh, soon we'll be closing out uh, Module 5 and beginning Module 6. Uh, I wanted to say about Module 5 that I really enjoyed reading the elevator speeches. Uh, I thought that those uh, uh, were uh, really interesting to see how you went about uh, framing and communicating uh, the essentials of what you do as a chaplain. And I believe that uh, your interaction with each other uh, probably will help you refine and expand the things that you would say and, and maybe find more uh, condensed and uh, impactful ways uh, to say it. So those, those were uh, very nice to read and I hope that that was uh, uh, helpful to you. We're going to move on uh, soon to uh, Module 6. Module 6 is uh, written by uh, Martha Ruffin. She's a board-certified chaplain. And uh, she has given much uh, time and reflection uh, to uh, uh, processes of self-care and, and self-nurturance. And she has shared our, her thoughts about this and her practices uh, about it with us. So uh, I recommend it to you. Uh, self-care and, and uh, nurturing oneself is uh, probably one of the biggest challenges uh, for people uh, committed to caregiving professions. I think especially chaplains uh, working in palliative care settings uh, because there's, there's so much need for your services and, and your presence is so important to people that uh, uh, I know you're always on uh, emotionally and spiritually in one fashion or another. But as you've heard, you know, many times before, it's especially important for the caregivers to take care of themselves so you remain fulfilled and enriched and have abundant uh, resources uh, to share. Uh, Martha shared with us a number of exercises uh, that she's found helpful. And I believe that uh, the collaboration that you do around the sharing um, your own uh, struggles and successes with self-care uh, will be very helpful to each other. So I wish you well in this module. And uh, again, please complete uh, the uh, post-tests and module feedback. And if you're having trouble, technical problems with any of that, uh, please let me know. Uh, have a great week. Bye.